for the messy haul. It's Sammy, welcome to another sassy vlog, vlog, and welcome to this if you are new. I have a girly haul, like pick me up haul, which is some things I bought, and then I also have like Christmassy stuff that I bought. Still deciding on what I want to do with the place because I'm getting a new television, I'm gonna have like a whole new, a whole new setup in here. Tomorrow I have someone coming over to measure for like custom curtains. We're getting it together, we're getting her together. Who's ready for the messy haul? Are you ready? Okay. First thing I picked up um was these ultra mini uggs i don't know what the spot is it was just on there already but they're so stinking cute they're fresh to death i'm gonna try to keep them clean i have this little ribbon that i tied on the back the ribbon i don't know where it's from but it came wrapped around this little outfit that i also purchased from a brand called Le nuage something like that i mean the cloud which is just like so pretty if you know you know sorry about the lighting shift but it's like pink just so stunning so comfortable i will have the uggs and this really pretty love lounge set linked down below i'm wearing the size extra small i personally like how it fits i could have done a small or medium for like an oversized baggy but i feel like i own so many like baggy clothes i wanted this one to kind of be fitted to my body so i'm obsessed with it and they were also super sweet to give me a coupon code sammy moon for so many off your orders not sponsored just want to share cute things with you guys next i also got a new dance bag it's so cute this is by the brand so dance i'll also have this link down below i just put my water bottle on the side my booties first of all i'm obsessed with the pockets and the zippers on this thing literally this is the first pocket my messages are going off right now there's another little zipper where you can also put your cards or a notebook and like a pen in here i just think it's so cute so you can use it also as a work bag traveling it doesn't matter and it also comes in like a black and teal this side is where i would put like my laptop and it has this little velcro strap to keep it in place another zipper compartment you flip it around another zipper compartment and it also has a built-in like water bottle holder it's kind of hard to show you because my booties are weighing the bag down but right here on the side if you can see you can put a water bottle in the inside and have it stand up and not spill all over your dance goods so love i'm trying to find all the regular stuff so i can just do all the christmas things together the shower gel shampoo combo i'm obsessed it smells divine i knew all the girlies had this for years i would always see it on like pinterest and their feed and i'm like what does it even smell like i've never seen it in the stores only i got like a mint and like is it a mint it's like a sage it's a green one i also picked that up but it's in the bathroom i've been using that that smells divine i also have like the vanilla one i don't know but i've never seen the amazing grace so i got her really random i picked up this little surge protector i just like that the packaging is pink picked up this betsy johnson cosmetic little travel case i'm going away for christmas we're going back to lancaster pa i live in pa so to go to lancaster is like an hour and it's not even that far but it's still a vacation for me because i despise the city i love 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 the farm and open space and land i just love the vibes so i got this new little travel case to bring with me it's a little more spacious slightly bigger than my kylie cosmetics case plus the inside is black so you won't see all the dirt that gets in your makeup case one side for skincare one side for makeup and she's cute i do kind of like the kylie one a little better i'm just just gonna put that out there because when you open it it has a third compartment for like little contacts cotton swabs like minuscule things and then it also has a hanger where you can just like hang it up while you're getting ready which is also really nice this doesn't have that but it's super cute so had to have it and we love betsy johnson next i picked up this continuous little water mister all the girlies also have this where you kind of spray it and it's like a mist and not like the squirt squirt next i picked up this little three-piece little kitchen set it's like a cutting board kitchen shears and a knife which is also really nice because i don't own kitchen shears i have other scissors that i keep around but they're not like for opening bottles of wine and like a canister jar whatever like it's nice to have actual kitchen shears that will stay in there next i have this little muffin cupcake pan that comes with pink and blue liners they could have picked any color but they picked pink and blue and it's just so cute next i picked up this little mug every time i vlog and show a mug i tell you guys every single time i don't need any more i'm not buying anymore my home cannot physically fit another mug but since i'm doing like rentals and stuff 
we're gonna find a place for everything and we're also gonna donate a lot as well so i got this one and she is so cute i've really been into like the hot pink moment i don't know maybe i'm just settling because everything doesn't come in baby pink but she's so cute oh i also got some slippers i'm wearing them right now but i love these these are by laura ashley these are my go-to i buy these all the time next i got some little journal things for planning so 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 cute the first one is this mini pearl vibe with a rose gold matching pen it's just a plain old notebook so cute but i can't lie and i can't be the only girly that low-key just like these for decoration i would love to use them but i'm one of those girls if i'm writing sloppy or if i don't know what i'm doing i'm just gonna keep tearing pages and tearing pages so a lot of these little notebooks just sit around my house as decor for that reason alone and then this next one i got is like my favorite type of journal the spiral so when i'm writing i don't have to worry about the pages folding over i literally could just flip it all the way back and write on a flat surface where it says for with god nothing shall be impossible luke 137 comes with these really pretty stickers just dividers before a set of notebook paper this one just says positive mindset embrace life have faith believe in yourself we all need that especially when planning and when we feel like burnt out and defeated believe in yourself because you can do it i'm sitting on my knees and they're like hurting next moving on to bathroom and the bedroom i picked up these little basic pink rugs because i personally like the white ones but i'm here to tell you i'm in my bathroom a lot between taking a bath changing my clothes doing my hair doing makeup having guests the white carpets get disgusting okay and i wash them so often that it's burning me out anyways i settled for the cutest pink ones that they had they're just this rectangle shape i'm not gonna lie i think the second one is a little too long and then i got this honey and lila throw blanket i am thoroughly obsessed with her she's so so cute i know it's giving spring and not so much christmas but how many times am I gonna put a snowflake blanket on my bed or something with gingerbread? Like, be let's be real. Flowers are kind of like an all year round thing for me. I just love the vibe, it's just pink and white. This feels even softer than the Barefoot Dreams and you guys know how obsessed I am with my Barefoot Dreams like Cinderella collection that I got. Girl, I picked up a Laura Ashley shower curtain. I believe the one that I also have in my bathroom right now is like all blue floral. That is Laura Ashley, if I'm not mistaken. Um, this is $16.99. So pretty. It's just giving like this floral design. And right now I have like the basic white plastic, or not white, the acrylic plastic little shower curtain ring. So I was like, let me upgrade. This sound might annoy me because there's like going to be metal on the metal rod, but who cares? They're super cute. And y'all know me. I'm not into glam. That's why I have like the basic acrylic ones. But these were super cute not to have. And they were only $6 for a set of 12. Last, I got the Tovalo little ice cream tub. Every time I go to the Home Goods TJ Maxx, I see this and I don't pick it up. But I saw one again with a pink lid. And I'm just like, let me get it now before they don't have it. So she's so cute. It's a silicone lid. And literally just like an ice cream tub. And it's just so pretty. It says ice cream, sorbet, gelato. All around the rim of it and you can just make your own little goods so nice and this will also encourage me to use my Vitamix more and just do more things and recipes with that so that's everything that I got I believe that's not Christmas related so I'm gonna put all this back in a little tote push it to the side and then we're gonna get into the Christmas stuff first things first gift boxes I am fairly obsessed with gift boxes at the moment and these are super pretty they're like white and pink with a snowflake design on you guys are like lopsided i'm so sorry is it fixed i don't know okay i'm gonna try to speed through this just so you guys are not subjected to like my tangents but i just have to explain why i got everything to kind of validate me spending money <laughs> anyways i got these really pretty gingerbread um why am I blinking? Hand towels. What I normally do, like most of them come in a set of two. I'll keep one in the bathroom and I keep one in the kitchen and kind of rotate them weekly. Next, I picked up the little multi-purpose cleaning gloves. These are not Christmas related. I'm pretty sure I got them at the time I got that stuff, but it just ended up in this tote. Anyway, you can never have too many cleaning gloves, especially if they're coming in baby pink. Yeah, next I got this throw blanket. I kind of settled for this one because one, it's Betsy Johnson, two, it's pretty cute, and three, I couldn't find the ginger snap one, ginger old snap, 
You know what I'm talking about. So we got a gingerbread little cookie candy jar. So how I saw two in the store, but one was like, this part was broken off. I was like, who, who was hating on the pink Christmas decor? Who did that? We didn't even put it where this was. It was by the throw blankets. I was like, are you kidding? They are not. These are really pretty trees. Like three mugs. The first one was a gingerbread one because it's in the sink. I used that yesterday. I got a gingerbread house. I actually got this when I first saw it at the Home Goods CJ Maxx. And that's before all those TikTok videos came out and started going viral. Had I known there was like a whole line of gingerbread stuff, I would have gotten it before TikTok sold out all the stores so we got her she's so cute i'm not gonna lie i do love these mugs i don't like that you can't really clean in the inside of these i also picked up the tis this season to be jolly little napkins i'm not a huge fan of red but candy canes are like i'm okay with candy canes so i love that it came on those so pretty and the last thing in this bag are gift boxes i got them in three different sizes but they're all the same exact thing so we got a little medium size i got the small size if you guys can see i really got these to be the filler like so my tree isn't just bare again we're not going to be here for christmas so i doubt that i'm gonna actually put presents under the tree we might just do like a pollyanna exchange or something when we get there you can never have too many bows and like a pink and gold moment i believe this is the last tote i'm looking around <laughs> uh, we're almost there guys I also picked up this really pretty, I guess you can say a gingerbread mug, like the little homes, but this is all pastel versus the brown. So pretty. I don't know. It just gives me Nutcracker vibes too. Uh, I love it. I'm a really big fan of the red and pink vibe. So the little stem is red and then the cards are like this pink and white stripe, which you know I love if you've been watching for a while at my mom's house in the like girly cave. I had pink and white striped walls. This one says Holly Jelly and happy holidays and then on the back you can kind of see what they look like for the to and from i got the let's get holly and jolly napkins these are really pretty it has like cupcakes and mistletoe little or not mistletoe like the holly on there anyways these are like a little hand cream trio i mainly got it for the packaging it's like a nutcracker and the ballerina i thought these were ornaments but they're not they're just hanging here and it's so pretty the scents are sweet mint vanilla shea and honey almond so cute and then I got this little lip balm set. It's vanilla sugar, peppermint, honey almond, and a berry frost. Again, the packaging kind of sold me on it. And that's just to keep in my dance bag, one in the bathroom, one in the kitchen, you know what I mean? Like just all around the house because my lips get so dry during the season. This is probably like my favorite purchase. I couldn't find these in store. I actually was shopping. I don't know if it would be in this vlog or if it was in the last vlog. I went to the store when I got the little gingerbread mug and I didn't even realize that underneath me was the red and white candy canes. I didn't realize until I went back and edited the footage. I was like, they were right there, but they weren't my color scheme. Could have got those for my mom. But again, I saw all that stuff or went shopping and it was in stores before everything went viral and got taken. But it's okay because I found these on Poshmark. I think they normally retail for at least $20, $25. I paid way over that. It's okay because they're cute and that's all that matters. So I got my hands on a set. So pretty, so perfect. This is by the brand Cynthia Rowley. And we love her. I have PJs by her. Love, love, love Cynthia. Her stuff is just divine. So I got these to kind of go on the couch. I'm also looking for a new couch again. Anywho, this isn't Christmas related. It also just ended up in this tote. But I did get this for my bedroom. It's a little glam. And if you know, you know, I'm not a super glammy girl. But I did splurge on those little curtain things so when it came to the bedroom i'm like okay i got a new bed i got a new dresser i have roses in there my mirror is giving immaculate so i needed to get a little immaculate little box and it's so pretty it opens like it opens all the way i do love the ridge textured glass and you can like see up top it's like a blush pink um, but what really sold me you're not going to believe this but i do appreciate the claw foot feet in this little embellishment that is the only part that sold me on this item the little claw foot tub feet it's just so pretty action i got this little tea set it comes with two saucers two teacups and a little pitcher it's just so pretty and i almost can never find anything by the shabby chic line in store ever since the target blankets and like throws got taken out 
It's just so pretty. I want a little bistro. I've been dying to find the perfect little mini corner bistro nook set so I can make like a little lottery cafe vibe in the corner off the kitchen looking um, under this little mantle opening that I have here. And I think this set on the table would just be divine. And lastly, <laughs> I'm gonna show you what I got from Bath and Body Works. Are you ready? Let's go through the hand sanitizers first because these are like the least important. They just smell good. And I bought them for my dance bag. I also bought a keychain for this. I don't know where it went. Yeah, it's in between the bags. Did I, sh I feel like I showed you guys this stuff in the last vlog. Maybe it was one of the mugs. I don't know, but she's so cute. Um, I actually was gonna get that the first time I saw it when I went vlogging, I think in the last video, but the customer service was disgusting. I was like, oh, I'm ready to check out. And then she was like, I'm waiting on somebody. And I was like, oh, I'm sorry. Cause I see no one else in the store, ma'am. So I left, I put everything back and I left and I went back and there was this amazing woman who helped me and my sister. And she was just so kind, same location. It costs nothing to be kind. So like, even if you dislike your job or something, don't take it out on me. I didn't ask you to work here, you know? I shouldn't even be asking you to do your job. And you know, I'm going on a tangent, I'm so sorry, but what gets me is when people complain about their jobs while they're working. When I get home and I'm ready to vent it like a friend, oh yeah, like lay it on the table. But if you're like a cashier, like a clerk or whatever, and you are ringing me out, this has happened so many times, especially in Walmart. They're like, I wanna go home, I can't wait to go home. Like, oh, I hate being here late. And I'm like, as you're ringing the customer out, this isn't cute, boo-boo, it's cute. Keep your like secrets to yourself. We don't want to hear that. So if you're having a bad day, just don't take it out on other people because you don't know what kind of day I was having that could have came to the store for a pick me up and you were rude. Back to the hand sanitizers, I got Winterberry Ice, Vanilla Bean Noel, cause this is iconic, Frozen Lake, just this makes me want to go ice skating, um, Gingerbread Bakery, Strawberry Snowflakes, Golden Berry Mistletoe, Vanilla Icicles, Frosted Coconut Snowball, Luminous, this is also one of their newer fragrances, not Christmas related, but it smells so good I had to have it. And then lastly, I got Bright Christmas Morning. I also picked up this vanilla lip mask. I don't know if this is like a newer product, but the lady pointed out that they had a ton of new lip things. And you know, I'm a lip girly. I love my Summer Fridays lip butter bomb, especially anything vanilla. Oh, it smells so good. Are you kidding? This looks so nice. So cute. It's giving like Laneige, but about the body works. Um, and then I got three candles. This first one is Champagne Toast. I love Champagne Toast. Someone actually bought... I had something from... Was it a shower gel of that scent or a candle? Someone got it for me for Christmas. I was like, hello, I need her. So I love that they put that scent in a Christmas jar because I'm obsessed with the nutcrackers they're so pretty champagne toast is just bubbly champagne sparkling berry sweet orange and then natural essentials i love 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 this and it makes sense because if you guys ever get the vaseline lip therapy i always get like the bubbly rose champagne i am just obsessed with things that smell like this so and then i got mary cookie oh smells so good <gasps> mary cookie fragrance notes are fresh baked cookies sparkling sugar crystals and rich vanilla i love any and everything vanilla is just such a classy timeless scent i also am a chocolate girly this candle i got is like a little eight ounce this is and the hot cocoa and cream this smells really good but this is one of those scents and fragrances that can be overwhelming if you burn it too long so i didn't want to get a larger candle in it i'll get on it Prince notes are decadent milk chocolate fresh steamed milk and mini marshmallows which sounds so pretty but it literally smells exactly like what the fragrance notes says i got the vanilla icicles toasted vanilla chai everything smells good if i have it it smells good um iced cinnamon rolls i don't know if this came in filming and why i got the gel i don't know um strawberry snowflakes this just smells so good <sighs> so good i can't open it and i'm gonna keep trying to hurt myself and the last two literally remind me of lottery they're just so pretty this is fresh sparkling snow there we go and this is pink sparkling spritz so pretty i just love the monochromatic moment of the snowflakes so that is everything that i picked up really big haul it was very lengthy i tried to get through it we've made it i need to touch up my makeup it's getting disgusting i'm gonna show you guys these clips really quick hold on let me get my basket i'm the i teach you i are up no i am not 
I don't know if you guys have been keeping up with my Sassy Ever After shop. I have some things dropping this month for Christmas. I'm going to be doing a Christmas jumper. And these hair clips were supposed to be a part of the Christmas release. But since I'm wearing them and they're so cute, I was like, let me put you guys on. So these are mine. I'm not like mixing these in the pile because they have been in my hair. But this is the first Cloudy Claw Clip. Obviously, I named it Cloudy because it's in the shape of a cloud. This is in Morning Meadow. This one is Cottage Garden. So pretty. And then we have the Presley Pink. I think one of my favorite things about having my own shop is naming the things that I launch. I don't know why Antoinette zip putty and my Audrey zip putty and the Bentley bow and the Bowie bow like I just love the names of everything obsessed but let me show you guys what this looks like really quick with my short hair she's just so cute I love them so much and I love that they're clouds like are you kidding anyways I have a few in this little basket that was given to me hey guys change of scenery I just came from the house I took a nap and now I'm here with Sadiha Hello. <laughs> We're mad at Ross. <laughs> okay, I'm gonna show you. Ready? Okay. Okay. Excuse me. I'm so surprised. Well, I really don't, but I love you. Okay. Keep going. You know what it is. No. I think it's a cloud. Yeah. It's so cute. No, I love it, guys. This is my first cloud pillow. Thank you. It's so cute. No, I love this. You know, there's a brand called um. Is this squash mouth? No. It's, a, mm -mm. it's from a Japanese store I found. Look at this. This is so cute. And it has rainbow feet. Um, I love it. It's so cute. I had and I was looking for cloud stuff and I Stop. found this. Me and my friend were on a cloud vision. I was like, we have to find something. <laughs> what did she say? She probably like, she's such a little girl. No, yeah. she helped me find it. Oh, you're we, such a cute yeah. girl. I'm glad you like it. Oh, I love it. That's why I brought the bag. Oh, good, good. No. <laughs> I was like, I forgot what you were like, I hope it's a keychain. I was like, it's not. A, it's bigger than a keychain. <laughs> she's like, it's bigger. <laughs> she's so cute. Cute. I'm so happy to see you. Again. I know. What, what, are we, what are we looking at? Oh, I'm, oh, I'll show you the dog stuff. Oh, don't forget your camera. So she's getting this for her dog. It's giving Lumberjack farmhouse dog. <laughs> so cute. And they have like the little glass Christmas tree for dogs. Oops, I it keeps this. coming off. With the little, like, something, something. Oh, there it is. Wait, you're not focused. Okay, show them. <laughs> so cute. I, but it's like baby blue. It's giving Cinderella Christmas. You should get it for your future doggo. You think it weighs three ninety nine? That's really cheap. Is it squeaky? Oh, yeah. it is squeaky. I don't feel like cutting it out. <laughs> Queen. Guys, these are so like pretty. It's giving shabby chic love strike fancy, but they don't have it for a full. Yeah, this is. Do this is know? literally me and a dog. So cute. Uh, for all the people that said it's not Christmas time yet, they're playing Christmas music, which means it's Christmas time. No one likes Thanksgiving. <laughs> Thank you very much. So cute. Well, if this store closes in five minutes, should we see what time the other one? 0.15. Well, now 12. What? For your future, this is so stunning. This is a wedding doll set. Are you kidding me? You're like, I want this. <laughs> this one is so pretty. Okay, babies. I am home. Uh, I brought out the big jacket. I actually accidentally put this in the washer so i feel like it's not as fluffy as it used to be which kind of sucks because this jacket was like six hundred dollars but it's still pretty cute it's by coach in case you're wondering it's a stunning stunning jacket if i could find it i'll link it down below but if not i'll still put the name in case you guys can find it secondhand i'm upset so i'm wearing a size small for reference then i brought out my little victoria's secret scarf because i saw a tiktok that was like, you don't get sick from the weather. And I'm like, I know that part. That I do know. You're not going to get sick because it's cold outside. You know what I mean? You get sick from germs. And the girl was like, when it's super windy, the air just hits your neck like that. And like, it causes all the debris and things. That's how you get sick. So I was like, let me cover my neck. Um, but yeah, I'll show you guys what I got. It wasn't that much. First off, my friend bought me a little cloud. I think I might name it Pasadena because she was in L.A in the little town of Pasadena when she got it. So I think Pasadena would be really pretty. Has little rainbow legs and I'm gonna put this on the bed like this so she can like sit on the bed. It's just so cute and she knows I love clouds. If you know me, you know I love clouds and it just means so much to me. So thank you Media if you're watching, that is just so sweet. And then I picked up this really cute AirPod case for $4.99. Just like a little flower. It's just cuter than the one I have now. It's kind of more bulky. The one I have is like those little plastic ones and it just keeps falling off. So 
we're going with this the last glittery one i think was it kate spade it was something one of those glittery case they were so cute i gave it to my cousin because she was like i love your airpod case i was like you can have it the last thing i got for myself was a little rest spoon thing to go on my stove i have been looking for one of these forever but i couldn't find something that wasn't too seasonal you know what i mean like not a christmas one so it's it's really pretty it's giving like girly pastel pink florals it's kind of like spring but i love it and it's by the brand rosemary lane and the last two things i got were for jenny i almost always go to the store and get her something um it's just a habit so i found these really cute juicy couture little sandal sandals slippers why don't they have anything this cute for us so i don't know if i might keep these at my house for her or like if she'll take them home and then i also got her this little plant-based barbie lip gloss set because she loves makeup it says it's paraben free cruelty non-toxic non-gmo 100 percent fun like this is the kind of stuff i wish i had as a kid i mean we did but it was uh, what do we have as a kid it wasn't lisa frank why am i blanking on the name you guys know what i'm talking about we had them was it lip smackers we had oh uh, i just missed my childhood so much I hello sassies sorry this vlog has just been like everywhere it's from the beginning of november like it's the beginning of december i have been so busy so kind of like in a rut just out of my element when it comes to social media so i wanted to just finish getting this footage up for you guys i hope you enjoyed the haul if you want to see something in specific you know what to do let me know down below in the comments and if you want me to do a q a or go live again let me know down below in the comments and i just hope that you guys enjoy this vlog and nonetheless i will be doing like a pack with me travel vlog going away for christmas i'm still debating on if i want to put my tree up here or there i don't know i'm super indecisive but we're gonna figure it out so yeah i love you guys so much and i hope you enjoyed this video nonetheless don't forget to like comment and subscribe if you haven't already put in your post notifications so you don't miss any of my uploads and i will see you boost in my next sassy little laggy vlog